The case closed stays handicap the last race on day week three day one at Kempton. Number one is Infinite Prospect for David Robertson. Two is Never Sure. Three is Maiden Brumier. Four is Billy Isle Paul Rhodes. Five is Harberry Ladybird for Graham Clutterback. And six is Alamo Reaver for James Shea. At the start. And away they go. Good break by most. Um, the two yellow capped horses with the light blue and purple stri pink stripes of Maiden Brumier and Infinite Prospect in the lead. But down the outside, Billy Idol for Paul Rhodes has picked on to pick it up. So Billy Idol leads it from Alamo River for James Shea on the wide outside. Then comes the grey Maiden Brumier for David Robertson. Uh, Craig Beck was never sure behind that. Then comes Infinite Prospect and Highbury Ladybird for Graham Clutterback at the back of the field. There's really no, no, no pace on you and no one really wants to lead. And it's uh, Buddy Idol, a reluctant leader at this stage from Alamo River on that one's outside. Now Never Sure goes to take it up. So Never Sure the leader from Buddy Idol. On the wide outside is Alamo Reaver. Then comes the Maiden Brumier. On the inside is Infinite Prospect. And traveling wide is Harbury Ladybird. But only about uh, three or four lengths off the lead in this tightly clustered field. So they go past the winning post for the first time and go on out in their second circuit and Billy Idol is now the new leader from Never Sure. So Billy Idol leader from Never Sure. Then comes Alamo Riva. Behind that is Infinite Prospect, Harbury Ladybird on the outside of Madden Brumier. But it's only four or five lengths from first to last as Billy Idol now tries to pick up the pace in front from Never Sure in second. On that one's outside is Infinite Prospect. Wide out wide of those and the green colours is Alamo Riva. Then back to Harbury Ladybird, the grey with the Welsh colours and the grey with the pink and blue uh, colours is uh, Madame Brumier for David Robertson about four or five, about five lengths off the leader which is still Billy Idol for Paul Rhodes. So Billy Idol carts him along from uh, Alamo Reaver travelling three wide in between horses is Infinite Prospect. On the fence is uh, Never Sure. A two lengths back to Harbury Ladybird who travels up on the outside of Madame Brumier who is a tailor for David Robertson but only five lengths off the leader, which is still Billy Idol. So Billy Idol for Paul Rhodes, still the leader from on the outside, Alamo Reaver. On that one's inside is Infinite Prospect. Just behind that is Never Sure. Then comes Harbury Ladybird for Graham Clutterbuck. And at the back of the field for David Robertson is Maiden Brumier. So Billy Idol. Still the leader in this marathon race from Infinite Prospect in second. Then Alamo Reaver. Caught in the pocket behind that is Never Sure. Then Harbury Ladybird on that one's quarters. And Maiden Brumier is about two lengths behind in last position. The leader, Billy Idol. Two lengths clear of David Robertson's Infinite Prospect. James Shea's Alamo Reaver on that one's outside. Then comes Never Sure. About uh, two lengths back. Uh, Graham Clatterback's horse, Harbury Ladybird on that one's outside. And moving past uh, up to that one's quarters is Maiden Brumier for David Robertson as. Paul Rose's Billy Idol escapes now. Three four lengths clear of Alamo Reaver in second. Then comes Infinite Prospect on that one's inside. Uh, two lengths back to Never Sure. Maiden Brumier has now passed Harbury Ladybird, who is a new trailer. And the three grey horses are at the back of the field, but now about nine lengths off the lead over Billy Idol. Five lengths clear now of Alamo Reaver. Second, then just beyond that is Infinite Prospect. The second David Robertson horse of Maiden Brumier. The grey just uh, on the outside, never sure. They've been pushed along to try and prove their positions. And Harbury Ladybird patiently ridden at the back of the field. Billy Idol travelling comfortably in front from Alamo Reaver in second. Then comes Infinite Prospect moving up on that one's inside. Maiden Brumier behind that, then never sure. And Harbury Ladybird still the back of the field. Billy Idol has got uh, a pretty easy lead, um, clear by four or five lengths from Alamo Reaver. Infinite Prospect has always travelled well on that one's inside. Then comes Madame uh, Rumia and Never Sure and Harbury Ladybird at the back of the field. So Billy Idol, not so far clear now, three lengths clear of Infinite Prospect. It's always travelled well and is moving up to try to challenge the leader early. It's, Harbury, uh, it's Billy Idol from Infinite Prospect. Then comes Alamo Reaver. The Never Sure is trying to move closer with Maiden Brumier. No move yet from Harbury Ladybird and being pushed along at the back of the field. So Billy Idol has kicked again up front. Clear by five lengths from Infinite Prospect in second. Then comes Never Sure and Maiden Brumier. Alamo Reaver making no impression. Harbury Ladybird needs to sprout wings to win from there. 
It's Billy Idol who's kicked again. Looks like might have stolen this race from Infinite Prospect in second. Never sure they're not making much impression behind. Billy Idol with a furlong to go. He's starting to get wary. Infinite Prospect is trying to close him down. But Billy Idol with a half a furlong to go. He's going to hold on comfortably to win this. Billy Idol wins this for Paul Rhodes. Second will be David Robertson's Infinite Prospect. Close for third, but I think David Robertson might have got that as well with the Maiden Brumier. The winner was definitely Billy Idol. Paul Rhodes horse got an easy lead and stole the race and then kicked again in the straight. So Billy Idol, the winner from Infinite Prospect, back in second. Third place also went to David Robertson's Maiden Brumier. Fourth was Never Sure, and fifth was Highbury Ladybird, who made no impression back in fifth place.